she's an incredibly unique offering and individual and she's one that that we know quite well as uh, this will be our second time around selling her as a racehorse um, I mean what more could you want she's a multiple grade one winner from an incredible family she won grade ones on both coasts she won the grade one rodeo drive in California defeating three-time grade one winner hard not to like and then later on in the year you know she went on to capture the grade one first lady here at Keeneland, uh, defeating champion Teppen. And in that effort, she earned a 109 buyer, which is really just a remarkable figure. Well, I think she's, she's, she's special. Um, you know, it, it's, it's really hard to say what her greatest attribute is because she's got so many attributes. She's a grade one winner. She's got an absolutely spectacular, fabulous, sensational pedigree. She's in foal to arguably the hottest horse in the United States in Quality Road. You've got a warfront yearling on the grounds that the, that the owners are going to keep. She's the complete package. Uh, she's, she's young. She's, she's pretty. Uh, she's produced spectacular results on the racetrack. And she sure looks capable of producing spectacular results as a broodmare. Yeah, I mean, we all get tired of hearing ticking the boxes, but she truly does. You know, she has the pedigree. Um, being by Galileo, um, out of that kind of female family. Um, you know, she's got the physical confirmation um, so that when people look at her, they like her, they love her, um, you know, uh, she passes that test. And her race record, you know, a multiple grade one stakes winner and, you know, running against those kind of horses, beating Teppin. She's actually the fastest grade one winning daughter of Galileo in North America in over the last nine years. And the only grade one, or the only daughter of Galileo to post a higher uh, buyer figure was Magical, um, her three quarter sister who um, earned that, earned that uh, 113 buyer uh, when she ran second to Enable in the Breeders' Cup last year. So, you know, not only does she come from an amazing family by arguably the best, one of the best stallions of all time in Galileo, but uh, she was an incredible athlete and uh, just had the will to win that so many of the Galileos do. I think she's gonna appeal to anybody who wants to own the best. Uh, she's the type of mayor that, uh, you know, you, you could look back five years from now, 10 years from now, 50 years from now, and say, you know, the whole breeding program that I have was influenced by the acquisition of a mayor of the quality of a photo call. Uh, you know, the family that she's got is remarkable to date. And then you look up and you've got, you know, one of the best four-year-old fillies in Europe right now, Magical, who's bred along the same lines. She means a lot to us. Uh, you know, it's, it's very rare that you have the opportunity to handle a quality offering like photo call, let alone have the opportunity to handle her twice and she's been at the farm since the day that she retired. We've had both of her first foals. We've seen her transition from, you know, elite, uh, you know, amazing athlete to motherhood. And that's a very special thing for us to, to watch and to see her with her first foal, a filly by Warfront, who is being retained by, by Vinny and Teresa and is gonna go into training in Europe with John Gosden and then to see her uncle Mo Weanling that we have now, who is an amazing specimen and uh, you know a horse that you're just really excited to see grow up. She's pure class, and you know is just one of those fillies that she knows her job. She comes out and does it well, and uh, you know she's she's really a pleasure to be around. We're flattered and honored, um, and certainly up up to the task. So you know we're excited about it. I've. I went through the Phasic Tipton catalog. There's a lot of serious and wonderful horses in there, but as far as in full mares, I mean, I, I think, you know, she stacks up with the best of them, as you would expect. Mm -hmm.